do-it-yourself spa. I think a wonderful alternative to gifting is DIY projects. I've included two types of online gift certificates that you can do for gifting alternatives. Again, they won't wind up in the landfill. One of them is Willow Tree Acupuncture. Those of us who have a fear or feel queasy about acupuncture because of the needles, there are other types of acupuncture that can work wonders for self-care. This is a DIY self-care gifting idea. Dr. Reinhardt has been in business, I believe, for about 15 years, and she focuses one of uh, several of her treatments on facial, facial treatments. You can have cupping on your face. You can have a massage that will activate beautiful cells. All of this is included in my podcast, The Different Kinds of facial treatments that you can do at home. There is a special process that you can contact her about that I don't know how to pronounce it, but it is a type of massage. You need a special tool for this, which she provides, and she provides the training to do this. I believe it's a Japanese treatment that you can use on your face. It's much better than Botox and some of those other what I call invasive treatments for your self-care at-home package. The, her contact information is on my podcast details. The name of her facility is Willow Tree Acupuncture. You can choose treatments that have nothing to do with those little micro tiny needles because I get, I get queasy about them also. To combine that with another self-care package for DIY is a website called Made in Meditation. Carrie Kopasek has a beautiful website that's very easy to choose products, lots of free classes. You can get a gift certificate if you want to do a more intensive type of study. She also has an online shop now, which I've included with the link. This is a really cool way to combine two gifts for self-care DIY packaging. I want to share with you that this can be also male-oriented. Even though we think of facials, cupping, meditation as a female type of self-care, I know a lot of men who do meditation. I know a lot of men who will do acupuncture and they'll do facial treatments. Therefore, ladies, don't hesitate to step out of your regular gifting box. Ha, pun intended. That was pretty good, Valerie. Don't hesitate to give something unique. And again, these are presents that don't wind up in the landfill. I've also included meditation music, acupuncture music. Now, some of it's geared toward the holidays. One of them is about a nature environment. This one gentleman creates his videos and the music, and I've included his link. It's actually, it cracks me up. It's squirrels and birds with really beautiful music in in the background, but it can be multi-purpose because I read that even cats and dogs love watching the video. The music is very calming. I did include some instrumental holiday music with a beautiful scenery. Nice for gifting again, but if, when you go to either one of these YouTube channels, you'll see in their description that they have all kinds of scenes and all kinds of instrumental music that you can use all year long. So these are not just geared toward holiday instrumental music. Lastly, of course, I had to talk about wine really want people to think about cutting back or to really be careful about what they are drinking during the holidays because sometimes you go to these parties and it's really disgusting punch and you wind up with the worst hangover in the next day. I don't I don't do hangovers. I don't believe in them. You got to you got to be responsible. If you know they're not going to have something you drink at a party, take a non-alcoholic 
beverage or bring your own because there's no sense in drinking swill. I did include on the podcast details a crazy article about grower champagne choices. Grower champagne, in case you folks don't know, the growers of the in the vineyards, these are the farmers who are growing their own grapes for their own production, and they are expensive. However, it's an interesting article, and I think if you want to also step out of your box and look at other things besides Veuve Clicquot, and I hate to tell you, but it is swill, it is overproduced, uh, they do something that's called chaperonization. They make their wine sweeter because they believe Americans. Unfortunately, this is true. They believe in Mer- they believe that Americans like a sweeter product. It's disgusting. Don't drink Veuve Clicquot. I don't care if they come after me. But grower champagnes are expensive. The least expensive one I saw was eighty bucks, and I'm not paying eighty bucks for something you piss in thirty minutes. Uh, there are. I love Perrier Jouet. I do know some other inexpensive grower champagnes. Reach out to me anytime you want. I'm on Instagram. I'm on LinkedIn. My email address is always on the podcast details. To wrap this up, spa do-it-yourself gift packages are super cool for alternative gifting. And you have time because this package is up to you. You can just print things up and put them in a box and... Yeah, you send it send it to them via email if you want. There's so much fun with digital applications now that you can send this gift through the mail with gift certificate links and your whole idea of this DIY DIY self-care spa package. Listen to the music instead of a kundalini yoga class, which I usually include. Check out the music because it's really fun, really relaxing. Lastly, drink responsibly. Yes, stay away from this will. In conclusion, I'm Valerie Hale. I create this podcast once a week to improve your mindset, to help you have really cool, creative thoughts that just improve your lifestyle. I also teach classes, public speaking classes, to help you with your poise, help you with your self-confidence, And really improve your power in the world. Because when people listen to you, when you carry the voice of reason and inspiration, you've gained a power in the universe. Merci. Au revoir.